Hello everyone. Welcome back to Smart Recaps. Today, I'll show you a sci-fi action film from 2016. Title: Terra for Mars. Spoilers ahead. Watch out and take care. At the start of the film starts we see the future. In year 2097, when the population was increased and the government was worried about it. To solve this, they were thinking that they should go Mars and to examine the atmosphere there. Can humans live there? They send cockroaches because no matter it is cold or warm or whatever the cockroaches stay alive. The new scene that is shown in year 2597. There we see a girl named Nanao and the man named Komachi running on the street. The police were chasing them. For a charge of murder. A doctor holds them who works for the government. Did this guy look like a doctor? Well, he says you have to do a task for me. He says the cockroaches were sent to Mars before 500 years, you have to kill them so that I can remove all the charges on you. For this, he will also offer a lot of money. Komachi and Nanao agree on it. But they don't have to go to Mars immediately, they were trained for two years. There were other people with them who will go to Mars. Then they going there reach Mars. They spread the gas that can kill the cockroaches present on Mars. But when they search, the shocking thing is that they couldn't find any cockroaches. Person named Jin moving forward with his companion. He sees a creature instead of a cockroach and it was standing like humans. But it seems like it is half of a human and half of a cockroach. There is a stone or a wood in its hand. They hide behind a rock. Because these creatures were not looking innocent. Nanao and Komachi were also going together. They also see these creatures. Seeing them, they get scared. They stand still, but then the creature comes very fast towards them. It breaks the neck of Nanao. And disappears from there. Nanao dead at the spot. Don't know why it was do this. Jen's team arrives and informs Komachi about their findings on another side. The monsters also murder Asuka. Teams run back to the ship and inform the captain about the creature. They find that the captain was already aware of the monsters, but the doctor had instructed him not to inform the team members about the creature. The captain adds that the cockroaches were dispatched 500 years ago. They developed at a quick pace due to the quantity of radiation and have now evolved into monsters stronger than humans. The doctor now appears as a hologram in front of the team assuring them that they have nothing to be concerned about. For a long time, the doctor had been planning for this very moment. He has specially created injections for each member that will bestow them the abilities of various insects. The medicine will improve their RNA by mixing it with the insects. They can defeat the developed cockroaches by using their special abilities. The members on the other hand, do not wish to combat the cockroaches. Rather, they want to terminate the trip and return to Earth as soon as possible. However, the beast quickly encircle their spacecraft godly. A daring crew member offers to distract the cockroaches until the others can restart the ship. He goes outdoors and injects himself with the medication prescribed by the doctor as soon as he does. So, his body undergoes a fast transformation transforming him into a combination of human and ground beetles. Lee's new abilities allow him to fire out flames from his body. Lee fights cockroaches that seem to be very strong. He employs his one-of-a-kind ability and fires fire from his hand. The power of the flames forces the creatures back and burns them yet as it diminishes it is revealed that just the creatures, exoskeleton is burned, a cockroach then rushes up to him and kills him in an instant. At the ship, a creature climbed on a window. It breaks the glass and killed two crew members. The captain injects himself and starts mutating his mutation is based on bullet ants, making him much stronger. Captain easily kills the creature. But the radar detects hundreds of insects coming towards the ship. They must leave Mars to survive. They attempt to start the engines but the engines don't work. It's like someone sabotaged them. The captain decides to distract the bugs, while they go to the old ship, to find parts to repair the engine. Ichiro volunteers to stay and help the captain. Komachi sees Nanao's body before leaving, he promises to return. He notices a strange string coming out of her mouth. The crew goes into the rover. Tuzuka injects the serum he transforms into a beetle. That can shoot projectiles. He propels the rover by shooting flames from his mouth. Ichiro and the captain fight the insects. Ichiro runs to expel all the oxygen from the ship, attempting to kill all the insects. The bugs begin to fall to the floor, Ichiro faints as well. At the rover, the crew sees a big wave coming. It's made of bugs and they have to fly through it. They make it, thanks to Zuka. They continue on their way, but see a second tsunami bigger than the first one. Osaku and Maria transform and go outside. 
to protect the ship. They try their best but the vehicle ends up, flipping over. The rover goes into autopilot and drives of the girls left behind. Fight the insects, but get defeated. The team wakes up at the old ship. Komachi looks for the girls but can't find them. They hear shoots outside they go check the noise and find two dead crew members. The bugs learn how to use tools and killed them with their own guns. Komachi injects himself he turns into a hornet he is very powerful and easily kills the insects. Jin mutates into a locust and he kills some roaches with his kicks. Mina become a mantis and slashes some of the insects they easily win the fight. Dr. Honda speaks to one of the bugs. The bug goes to the ship and turns the oxygen back on. It points a gun at the captain. All of a sudden, the bug splits into two. Azuka comes from inside. She is based on an emerald wasp and she can control the roach's body. Earlier she used her powers to make the bugs fight each other. She dries her hair and shoots the captain. She wakes up Ichigo, his mutation can survive extreme conditions. But requires water to reactivate, Azuka and Ichigo are on a secret mission by doctor. Ichigo was the one to sabotage the ship. They have orders to bring cockroach eggs back to earth. Komachi's team hear the ship taking off. The doctor explains to them through the drone, he never planned on exterminating the bugs. He wants the roaches DNA to make mutant soldiers for the government. Which would make the country become very powerful. Their mission was for research purposes, and their fights have been recorded for data. It turns out. The injections are made from a roach. The mission recovered and Azuka are taking off. Suddenly the egg hatches two evolved insects. Azuka tries to control them, but they evolved immunity and they kill her. The ship starts fly, two bugs call for help. The rest of the insects start flying to the ship. They swarm the ship and it malfunctions crushing back down. The insects surround Komachi's team and attack them. They transform and fight the bugs. They easily kill the normal bugs. But the two evolved insect, they are much more powerful. Mina attacked by the bug. Rips her arm and kills her. Jin injects a second dose of the serum. He mutates even more becoming much stronger. Komachi does the same thing, they continue fighting and killing their enemies. Jin jumps and injects one more time. The injection gives him wings. The roaches start flying but can't match his power. As they fight the team becomes tired Jin injects multiple doses, making his transformation permanent. But also making him stronger. He kicked by the leader bug falls down from exhaustion. Komachi defends him but the leader injures him. As the roach is about to kill them. Suddenly a glowing creature comes flying towards them. It's Nanao, that has evolved she flies and dropping dust. Komachi tries to save Nanao. But Jin informs him she's been dead. Now a roach shoots Nanao, making the powder explode. Jin jumps and saves Komachi, he cries seeing Nanao burn. When Komachi wakes up, he sees Jin has transformed into a locust looking creature. Jin tells him to leave. He goes into the ship and finds Ichigo. Ichigo aims at him but save Komachi by shooting an insect behind him. They agree to cooperate until they return to Earth. The two then fired the escape pod and flew back to Earth. The doctor discovers that a Cairo has hacked into their system, and is live streaming the whole meeting, across the globe. Now that the Japanese government's secret has been disclosed to the world, the doctor's assistant begins to fear. The doctor on the other hand, seems calm and claims that he would sell all of the bug's data to other countries across the globe who are eager to purchase them. The doctor is threatened by the assistant who turns out to be a spy for the Japanese government. The doctor, is already prepared for the attack, deflecting the bullet with an active barrier. He then murders the assistant using a poison. In the spacecraft, they plan to expose. What happened to everyone participating in the mission? Komachi responds that he would build graves in remembrance of everyone who has died. The movie ends with this scene. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell.